everyone, this is Sierra from Crafty Crafters, and today I'm going to show you how to make this blue jay. So the band count will be approximate in the description below. And I'm going to be making a cardinal, so mine's going to be red. If you want to make a blue jay, you'll just need to use blue and the colors for the wing will be this. So... <coughs> To start, we're going to start by making the wings. I already have some feathers made, but I will show you all the ones you're going to need. So you're going to start by taking a red wrapping around your hook four times, taking a red and double looping it. a red and another red and then a red and a black and then you're just going to take black six more times so that's three four five six Seven, eight. So that's you're gonna need two eight, so they'll look the same. And then you're going to take a red double loop. If you are using blue and white, then please use blue and white if you're doing a blue jay. And then a black and a red. Oops. Black and a red. And then black's the rest of the way, so we all have seven in total. It's two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven. And you're going to need four sevens. They'll all look the same. And then we're going to do a six. So there, double loop red. red and a black then blacks the rest of the way so that's two three four five six so you're going to need two sixes and it doesn't matter if you're making a blue jay or a cardinal, the other six is all black. But you can make the feathers however you want them. It really doesn't matter. It's however you want them. So then we're going to do five. So cat band and a double loop. And then a black and a red. And then two, three, four, five. Okay, the other five is all black if you are doing the same as me. But if you're not, you can always make it however you want it. And then the last one is going to be four. So double loop. And then we'll have four in total. So one, two, three. 
three, four. So then you'll have all these feathers. So you need to make all of these feathers. So go back and please make all of them. The first three are all black. So now you want to grab your loom. This is in the offset position. And you're going to take red or blue, whatever color you're using. And you're going to go down. So you're two from the bottom. No. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Then the other. I'm going to stop one behind it. Okay, <clears throat> and then you're going to take your bands and you're just going to connect them like that. Okay, so taking all of your 12 feathers, so the one, the four, the one was four and the red at the tip is going to go right here the one with five in red six with a red tip one seven and then eight eight and then seven seven Sorry guys, it flew off my hook. Seven, seven, and the last seven, and then the all black six, all black five, and all black four. Okay, so I'm just going to turn these a little bit. I want them all kind of bending this way. Okay, so now we need to do our horizontals. So taking two bands, making a triangle. So we're just going to do a triangle all the way. Okay, so now we are going to loop. So go under the six. Yeah, okay. And then loop. And I'm just going to go back under the six and then 
soup. Ah. Make sure you get under all the feathers. Okay. I'll loop this up. So loop up the middle. And then the last row. Oops. <laughs> That was a close one. Okay. So now take any color band, go through the ends, and tie it off. So you need to go back and make another one of these but make it symmetrical. I only gave you the count for one wing with the feathers, so you need to repeat this whole video and make it symmetrical, because if you don't, then you're going to have two um, left wings, and you don't want two left wings. So, then you should have this and I am going to stop it here so go back and make it symmetrical and I'll see you all in the next video where we'll be trying to do the face of our bird. Bye!